Benchmarking is essential, you know, and I don't have the statistics right in front of me, but if you were to look at the Olympics and you go to the first Olympics ever, and you look at the speed of the, of the runners and you compare that to today, the runners of the past would never be in the competition of today, that we've made advances in, in the Olympic sports. Manufacturing has that analogy of an Olympic sport. We have to compete and compete differently, compete globally. And when we think about how that lays out, it starts with knowing how we stand, knowing our current state, knowing what's out there as the best practices and the benchmarks, and how do we achieve those benchmarks or how do we get better to, to be the leader in that race? Benchmarking is a great way for us to understand where we are and where we fit into our local companies and how we can be competitive for our employees and our customers. Benchmarking is really part of our continuous improvement process in which you know, we spend so much time working in the business that it gives us a second to take that step back and work on the business and really assess where we're at and where we're trying to go. Um, so oftentimes we think we have all the answers and the benchmarking process, it asks those right questions to make us look at each one of our functions and each one of our disciplines and make sure that we're really uh, scrutinizing ourselves and, and really working towards that continuous improvement process. I'm, I'm not a degreed MBA by any means, uh, and I, I'm always looking for something I can do to improve the company. And I know that the Spark survey is based on a, a well-known uh, performance excellence framework. And so I thought, why wouldn't I do it? It's, it's already laid out for us, uh, something that we can reference to see how we can improve our company. The Spark Awards is really motivating because I get to see kind of who's the best of the best and uh, know what my competition is for trying to be eligible for the awards. And also the networking is fantastic. I learned so much from my peers in the different VIA events and the experience of the benchmarking survey and just from being around them and getting complimentary ideas to the ones that I'm already bringing to my team. The Spark Awards is a great opportunity to meet those folks that did excel in the benchmark areas that we went through. Uh, it's a networking opportunity. We get to meet those folks, we get to talk to them, get to start picking their brains on how did you achieve the status that you have. But more so, it's a speaker series afterwards where the VIA invites those people that excel to explain more deeply how did they become a leader company in that best practice. You know, when I think of the word of benchmarking, I think of how burdensome that could be. It feels like a lot of work. And yet, we do benchmarking every day. We compare ourselves to something. We compare our company to something. Benchmarking puts structure around it. It puts focus on it. The, the questions are pretty simple. They're, they're check the box kind of questions. Um, which ones apply, which ones don't. It's not long, short, you know, long answers that you have to spend a lot of time on. And I think just reading through the questions and being honest with yourself uh, is a great way to evaluate. Start with one section. Um, and then once you get one section done, you'll find that, oh, okay, we can get two, three, four, five, and get through all six pretty quick and easily. Because what they'll realize is, while there are some things that they're good at, there's also some things maybe they haven't thought about it or they, they know their weakness. And it gives them the opportunity to kind of kind of check themselves, grade themselves with the opportunity then uh, throughout the next year following uh, benchmarking to work on those things. Benchmarking is a forever journey. It is 365 days a year. It's going to understand that current state, keep getting better, keep improving. The Spark Awards is that moment to celebrate. It's to reflect, it's to reset, it's to say, wow, look what we've accomplished and look how much more we can do and how much better we can get. And so that moment is just a celebratory moment that we deserve a collective high five.